Peace, YouTubers, everyone. My name is Illa G. I am a hip hop artist. I'm also the writer, creator, director of a web series called New York Minute, based out of Brooklyn, New York. And uh, first, I want to tell y'all, um, please like and subscribe to my channel, Illa G TV. Um, it's very important to leave comments in the comment section, you know, that way I know if you like the video, don't like the video, um, things that you want to hear, see, we talk about, and, you know, just do that for me. Go hit the subscribe button. Do that. How about that? Basically, I'm going to name these videos uh, Inside the Minute, for those that's a fan of New York Minute, or Inside New York Minute. Leave, if you leave a comment in the bottom, it'll let me know which one y'all like, and that way we can name it accordingly to what you, uh, is right. Um, these videos, I'm doing these to, to talk about, uh, New York Minute character interviews. I will bring some of those, your favorite characters of New York Minute, you know, have them talk about their lives so you get to, to know them more during this, because a lot of these actors are first-time actors, and, you know, we see how this impact them you know, doing this web series thing because, you know, to see their reaction of people coming to them and um, asking them for autographs, pictures, um, how they feel about the series, you know, people really think, really think they are the characters they play in. It's a show, people. It's a show. Scene breakdowns because I've learned a lot from season one to season two. I think I've grew, you know, tremendously from season one to season two telling the story with the camera as well as you know the words on the screen episode breakdowns because you know some people don't get it and you know it's just to give you more of an insight to see where i'm trying to go with this yes it's you know you can't just write frivolous things out there so how scenes are filmed you know we have a process amazing as that sounds we do have a process of getting scenes done and you know it's following the rules that I've learned and and put them in my own way because you know getting it is not easy putting together a web series believe me it's not easy believe me uh, the writing how I go about writing episodes and scenes because that is a process in itself. Uh, you want people, you want it to sound from the world I come from, which is, you know, the ghetto, street life, and it has to be entertaining at the same time. And directing actors, and directing first time actors. Uh, me being the first time director myself. So, this is what you have to look forward to with these series of of uh videos ha i got it right videos and uh yeah don't mind the plane that flies over the projects while we're filming it happens still hurt. i can't control it it's not like i can control it. and that's it like once again leave the comments at the bottom here we go I got the idea for New York Minute because uh, there was a, a burst in the web series thing with um, well, what caught on to everyone in the hood was uh, Money and Violence. And so, you know, I looked at it and seen, you know, it was how, how it attracted a lot of people when me being, once I told you I'm a hip hop artist, I'm competitive as shit. So I figured like, I'm like, yo, I could make one just as good if not better. So um, I started throwing around ideas. What, you know, what am I trying to say? Um, first, I remember picking up a book when I was incarcerated. It was about how to write characters. And I read that book and I just started practicing, you know, writing characters, you know. You have to remember when you write characters, even though you may not see them, they have to start from somewhere, which means they have to, you have to come up with a mother or father, um, you know, what schools they went to, what's their favorite things. This helped with dialogue. 
and dialogue is not the same what you would say in real life. We know a lot of things we wouldn't say in real life, but dialogue helps you understand and learn the character that you're being a part of that world. And so once I did that, thought about it for a while, and was just like, okay, let me come up with five individuals. Well, yeah, five, five, four individuals that, you know, they have different aspects in their life. As I created that, I started looking. Haven't I never went to film school? Uh, basically, YouTube is my film school, and I started learning of the the rules of how to write, um, how to develop characters. So I started developing them. You know, give them a goal. What's their goal? And it came up. I basically uh, took the life I know. The most natural thing is the life I know. I come from the streets. Um, like I said, I was incarcerated. I can't indulge in to things that I've done. But to come from that and basically to see, you know, America loves violence. You know, but let's put a message in there with that. And so, you know, mob movies, my favorite director as of now, was Martin Scorsese. Uh, there's a lot of people that I like, you know what I'm saying? They're different styles, there's all type of different styles. I like Spike Lee's style, Spike Lee has a jazz style. But, you know, I at the time, I didn't know what I really liked. I just know, as a person, I like watching a movie. Didn't understand what it meant. So, I just took the five friends, gave them all goals, and put them together. And still learning to this day how to do it and formulate it. And the title was either, actually, it was either going to be called either Lower Park. Because, all right, where I live at, in some of the houses, we have a up the hill and a down the hill. So you just, I didn't want to say that. So it was called Lower Park, down the hill. So it was either that or New York Minute. Every person that I've said it to gravitated to New York Minute. So that was the thing. Things can happen in the New York Minute. And just ran with it. Push forward with that. New York Minute is about five friends trying to reach their goals in life from the ghettos of some of the houses in New York City, Brooklyn, New York. Uh, we have Deuce, Simone, Trav, Frizz, Moss. Each character have their own goals, what they're trying to reach. I want you to follow them to see if they reach their goals. And uh, the, the trials and tribulations that they go through trying to reach those goals. And it's, uh, it's a hell of a thing. If you haven't watched it yet, go check it out. We have two seasons. New York Minute, season one, season two, Elegy TV. You should be on it watching it now. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell all your friends and share the videos. Please. Pretty much that simple. The premise of New York Minute is about change and how hard it is to change in a hostile urban environment. Coming from that lifestyle, you don't realize how hard it is to change, man. And, you know, when I was incarcerated, I've read a lot of books and seen that it's pretty much a trap. You know, it's, it's, it's to trap us people that has skin color like me um, to take you away from your family. You know, you want to do more things. You, you know, when you don't know better, all you know is you, most people just want to help their family out or survive and you know we want to become businessmen but it's that's not taught to us in school you know we want to know how to be prosperous here in america so you know when you don't have the education of how to be prosperous the correct way you tend to do means that's pretty much set up for us to fall into to be trapped to be incarcerated to get like cheap labor for our our work so but to come out of that and not go back into that life, it's hard. So it is very, very hard, you know what I'm saying? Because as what we say is getting money, it's just addictive 
as a drug itself. So, you gotta cut a lot of people off, man. I cut a lot of friends off to uh, to make sure I change and to so I could present videos like this to you guys. And I just want to see people with skin color like mine to do what you love. I had no clue I would love this stuff and now I'm very into it. So, But just do what you love and be good at it and learn it. And don't fall into the trap of the street. So that is the premise. I want people to understand that. Please do not fall into the trap of the street. It's very easy to get into, hard to get out of. So once again, to reiterate, New York Minute, the premise of the show is change and how hard it is to change in a hostile urban environment. I live in the projects. You don't get no more hostile urban environment than the projects in Brooklyn, New York City, let alone to be here when the crack era hit. It was very dangerous here. Very, very dangerous. You would get eaten alive if you were soft back then. Seriously. So, remember that. And <laughs> watch it change. Hostile urban environment. New York Minute. Here's right now, what's my filming advice for up and coming directors. Um, <clears throat> filming advice is, uh, really seriously sit down either with yourself or your team and come up with a plan of how to shoot. If you don't come up with a plan and you know, at least watch and learn how great directors plan out how to film, man, that's, it's tough. It's tough, and you, you gotta know your shots, know the shots you want for that day, that scene. Because if you don't, man, I mean, first season, I pretty much ain't know what the hell I was doing, but it was, it was tough to try to figure this stuff out. You just filming wild, and you know, a lot of things you may accidentally hit up on some things, but I see it's much easier to be organized and plan it out, plan out the shots, than just... And don't be afraid to make mistakes. Mistakes lead you to become better. You know what I'm saying? As Will Smith said, uh, fail often, fail forward. So, don't be afraid to make mistakes. Pick up a camera and film something, man. Film it, plan it out. Plan the scenes out that you want, and you'll see. It's a lot easier and be patient be patient also don't be so hard on yourself do not do that because I mean I'm hard on myself all the time you know, so, so don't it's a process and you're always going to be learning especially you know I talk a lot of so I want to get better my competitive nature hip-hop hello this video is a, a short one but I want to thank you all for listening and being prepared for more of these videos talking about filming. And uh, I'll also probably be putting up more videos about hip hop. Um, <clears throat> you know, my experiences with uh, rap group Mob Deep, Sean Price, let alone other things that, you know, I've been through with hip hop. And. These are things you're going to expect on my channel. Uh, we are working on season three of New York Minute now. I'm getting, you know, everything together as far as what I'm going to write, what everything is going to go on. Um, I will probably soon have, uh, forgetting, auditions. Ah! Auditions. We'll soon have auditions for, you know, some new characters for season three. Um, I will put that up. Make sure you follow us on NY Minute underscore series on Instagram. Uh, I'm gonna put the words up there somewhere along this line. NY Minute underscore series on Instagram. Follow us. Um, also, follow me on Instagram, Illogy2K. Do it. Do it now. And subscribe to the channel once again. Subscribe to the channel, Illogy TV. Thank you for watching. Please leave comments below. It's very important. Uh, it lets me know what you think. And. That's it, man. Thank you for Inside the Minute or Inside New York Minute. My name is Illa G. 
Bless you. Stay strong. Film something.